Hello, I'm Joe Beeler, and I will be doing a monologue from Crystal the Starving Class by, as Wesley. I was lying there on my back. I could smell the avocado blossoms. I could hear the coyotes. I could hear the stock car squealing down the street. I could feel myself in my bed, in my room, in this house, in this town, in this state, in this country. I could feel this country like it was part of my bones. I could feel the presence of people outside at night, in the dark. Even sleeping people I could feel. Even all the sleeping animals. Dogs, peacocks, bulls. Even tractors sitting in their wetness waiting for the sun to come up. I was looking straight up at all my model airplanes hanging by their thin metal wires, floating, swaying very quietly as if blown by someone's breath. Cobwebs moving with them, dust laying on their wings, decals peeling off their wings. My P-39, my Massager Mint, my Jab Zero. I could feel myself lying far below them on my bed like I was on the ocean and overhead they were on reconnaissance, scouting me, floating, taking pictures of the enemy, me, the enemy. I could feel the space around me like a big black world. I listened like an animal. My listening was afraid, afraid of sound, tense, like any second something could invade me, some foreign or something indescribable. Then I heard the packer come up the hill. From a mile off, I could tell it was a packer by the sound of the valves. The lifters have a sound like nothing else. Then I picture my dad driving it, shifting unconsciously, downshifting into second for the final pull up the hill. I could feel the headlights closing in on me, cutting through the orchard. I could see the trees being lit one after the other by the lights, then going back to black. My heart was pounding just from my dad coming back.